Have you ever felt paralyzed about not knowing what to do next? You know, that uneasy feeling when uncertainty kills you on the inside, getting you either demotivated or instilling fear and making you not commit to action. Maybe you're trying to pick up a new skill, maybe you're running a business venture, trying to change careers, or you know, just trying to make something out of your life. I'm sure you've been there. Starting something from scratch is hard enough, and staying committed to action, unsure of what's next can be daunting too. I know, the stop worrying, keep doing mantra kind of sounds straightforward, bland even. Do you have a better idea though? The overwhelm that comes with the uncertainty of the future makes you overthink. You have a hundred thoughts splitting your head in unison, mostly worrying thoughts, those of unfounded fears crippling you, forcing you to inaction. You begin to postpone work, you start to procrastinate. At this point, you think you need inspiration or maybe motivation to take action. Counterintuitively, just doing something brings about the motivation to continue doing whatever you set out to do. It could be the most boring humdrum of tasks. As much as monotony sounds boring, I think embracing monotony and repeating tasks or any sort of work helps you maintain momentum. It keeps you in the loop of action, which would beget satisfaction for the breeding action and setting up momentum. But the stop worrying, keep doing mantra begs the question, how do you keep doing? Working only with a goal in mind can be overwhelming. A goal is a target you set and try to achieve over the long term, which requires repeated short-term tasks. Now, repeated short-term tasks could be thought of as a system. While goals can give you direction, systems could help put in the work and help you move forward. The idea is to take small, actionable steps toward your goal. You break down your overarching goal into easy, repeatable micro-goals, which when consistently met, help you make progress and achieve your larger goal. For example, most run a YouTube channel with the goal of making money. But the goal of generating sustainable revenue with the YouTube channel feels very intimidating. So you break down your overarching goal, right? You start with creating a video per month. With time, you could ramp it up and create a video per week. Creating videos day in and day out is monotony. Your only focus is to put out a video per week. The quality of your videos, the number of subscribers, views, watch time improve over a period of time. And you're finally revenue positive on YouTube. What could you do today is literally what you have to look at achieving. The future is always going to be uncertain or worse even frightening. Your attention should be what is controllable. What you control is what you could actionably do today. Being self-aware, embracing uncertainty and small consistent wins keep propelling you forward. Finally, it boils down to having faith in the process and trusting yourself more than anything else. <laughs>